Hi guys, welcome to Tech Tutorial Guide. In this video, now I'm going to show you how to install Lollipop on your Galaxy Core Prime. So before that, we need to download firmware of Core Prime. So I have leave a link in description to download this file. So we need to download this Core Prime firmware, which is having 738 megabytes, and extract it to your new folder. So that after we can get the top file to place your top file in Odin. So then after open your Odin, if you are using version 3.07 means you, you will find the PDA section. Instead of if you are using version 3.09 or 3, version 3.10 means you can't find the PDA. Instead of PDA, you can find the AP. So place your top file in AP section. And other key, other options keep as such default. So check auto reboot and F dot reset time. So here now I am selecting the top file so it would take some amount of time to detect your top file inside the Odin so you must install the USB drivers on your device because in download mode your device won't be detected inside the Odin so because you must install the USB driver to detect your mobile inside the Odin so here you can find no it will be detecting anything so you don't bother about not responding or errors because it will be detecting the .top file so while using this you can find it so not respond Odin would not saying Odin would not responding after the few minutes it would automatically detect your .top file so here you can find now it will detect the .top file so first what you have to do means you need to play a power of your device then after we need to place our mobile at download mode by pressing the here you can find volume down home key and power key at the same time so here yeah, volume down home key and power key at the same time to place your mobile app download mode so here you can find the warning so just select volume up button to continue and then after what you have to do is you need to connect your device to a pc so now i am connecting my device to a pc after that it will restart the flashing process like a search here now i'm connecting so here you can find i have here after that it will odin would ring it will be available in comfort if you have installed the um, usb driver drivers main it would be shown on com4 after that click on start and it will start the flashing process if you didn't install any usb drivers on your computer pc or laptop it can't find the device in odin so it would take hardly Three to five minutes so don't disturb the usb cable while flushing process if you disturb the usb or uh, if you don't have the enough power in your laptop or mobile devices mean it would completely break that means hardly bits it would unrecoverable we can't able to recover the device so keep it in mind before flashing so be careful while flashing so don't touch the USB cables and charge your laptop as well as the phone up to 60 to 70% and if you have a desktop PC means use the CPU backup no, sorry UPS backup so here I think it would be completing right now after that it would automatically boot into your lollipop so here up to 80 percent of the flashing process has been completed over right now so i know i'm waiting until you can so here you can find it will flashing modem right now that would be known as the rl so here you can find it would be send the reset command and it will automatically reset our device so here it will be showing galaxy core prime logo that would be known as bootloader so here it will automatically erase the catch and wipe data factory to boot your device normally in lollipop so here you can find it would be showing samsung logo right afterwards it will boot in lollipop So here it will be showing and that is upgrading right now 
so that's all guys thanks for watching please like and subscribe my channel and share with your friends and if you have any doubts please feel free in comment section as i am always ready to reply your comments so don't forget to share